mask is the Angel of Darkness. And he is outside with his, well, he's, his partner is outside, and that's Bones the Cutthroat. If you were watching the interviews, you saw Bones the Cutthroat and Angel of Darkness have already challenged the winner of the tag team titles. They want a shot at those belts, but Angel of Darkness could end up winning the t heavyweight title tonight. Doing a little ceremony in the corner. Magnum Steel, of course, is Angel's opponent. And uh, it looks like Angel of Darkness just sprayed some kind of spew. And look at Angel of Darkness waited till Magnum Steel turned his back. And now he's being abused by the Angel of Darkness who just gave him a drop kick. I'm noticing that the Angel of Darkness is limping just a tad bit, so he might be injured. There goes Bones the Cutthroat keeping the referee busy as Angel of Darkness is choking away at Magnum Steel. Referee is, I don't know what's going on. He must be an official for the Akori, Akoi, Florida area because he is not an official RCW referee. And this is one of the reasons why. Most likely he won't be getting a contract with regional championship wrestling after this is over with. Looked like Magnus Steele was going for a suplex but he changed his mind in midstream. He tosses Angel of Darkness out of the ring instead and he gives a boot and a headbutt to Angel of Darkness, but he needs to keep his eye out for Bones, the cutthroat. Nice shot once again. What's he going to do with him? He plants him right into the corner post. Magnus Steel plants him into the next corner post. And then he backbreakers, Angel of Darkness, so he is definitely working on the back of Angel of Darkness. Like I said, the winner of this match will go against the Flamingo Kid Pinky later on tonight. And the RCW title will be on the line. The winner of that match will be the champion of this company. Angel of Darkness gets his face rammed into one of the chairs. A low blow will stop anything like that. Angel of Darkness throws Magnum Steel back into the ring. And now Angel of Darkness is going to the top. And he chops a fist right in to the face. The martial arts expert of Angel of Darkness. And like I said, he's, his back should be in pain and he's also limping. So he's, he's got a lot against him in this one. But then of course, then you got his partner Bones, the cutthroat is outside. A super kick, and Angel of Darkness is definitely back on top of this one. Little bit dazed and confused, but if he were to get the cover right now, if he would go for it, he would probably win. Now he's going to do some punishing maneuvers. He's going to start working on the legs of Magnum Steel. Nope. Got a two count, but that was about it. As Bones the Cutthroat looks like he's getting ready to sneak into the ring. Referee needs to keep an eye on that. Angel of Darkness looked like he was gonna toss Magnum Steel out and you can see Bones the Cutthroat is using something in his hands to keep pounding away on Magnum Steel. And then he poked him right in the eye. And now, wait a minute, the Flamingo Kid Pinky is now outside. I don't know why he's out there unless he's watching the talent that's out there. He's got a chair in his hands. I don't know what that was about. Oh, I thought it was over. Magnum Steel looked like he was done, but that wasn't the case. There's a shot. Now they're trading blows right there. And a low blow will stop that. And once again, Angel of Darkness is cheating by using the ropes 
And now Bones the Cutthroat is actually in the ring. Referee needs to get rid of Bones the Cutthroat. And while he was in there, Angel of Darkness was using the ropes to cheat. And now Angel of Darkness talking to the referee. Bones the Cutthroat was heading that way. Magnum Steel cuts him off with a blow. And now Magnum Steel, I think, has had enough. There's a chop by Magnum Steel. Another one by Magnum Steel. In the corner, referee should be counting and getting him out of there. Hip toss. Drops a knee, looked like he was telegraphing that one. Bones the Cutthroat is on the apron again, and he got a shot from Magnum Steel, finally. I was hoping he'd get him in. He's got him in a bear hug. And he rams his back right into the apron. Oh! He was heading, he was running in to do a, a spear type maneuver. And the Angel of Darkness uses his legs to trip over. Oh! Trips over. Magnum Steel, who landed face first into the apron, into the, the buckle there, and then Bones the Cutthroat low blows Magnum Steel. So Bones the Cutthroat is definitely doing everything he can to make sure that the Angel of Darkness comes out victorious on this matchup. What I think they need to do is get Bones the Cutthroat out of here. But just like that, Magnum Steel comes back Whips him into the corner post, but it's too hurt to follow up. And there's a rake in the eye once again. As you can see, Angel of Darkness hasn't been playing fair throughout this whole match between him and the. And it's obviously Magnum Steel is not only just. Okay, Angel of Darkness has finally been disqualified. He should have been disqualified long time ago. For more information on Regional Championship Wrestling, like us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash Regional Championship Wrestling and subscribe to the YouTube channel at RCW Promotions. It's Regional Championship Wrestling. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up on this video.